Okay, I have a weird request, DJ, but I've been on a mission to get Weezer played at this competition. So after I perform, if you could play Weezer, that would be great. Okay. <laughs> on another note, hi, my name is Trinity Johnson. I am a senior at Westside High School. Slay! And this is my poem, Sit Down Comedy Because I'm Fat. Since I can remember, I have let my body control me. You see, whether it's the way I sit, the way I walk, I can never be content with just being me. I let my character cover up for the fact that I'm choking on my body image. I let my personality carry. Fat people are the funniest, right? Right? I can't remember the last time I ate three meals in a day. Let alone two, is it that bowl of spaghetti is judging me? Why do I keep judging me? Is it because ever since I roam the halls, the chatter of classmates always seem to be negative? I become Tupac, all eyes on me, most famous fat person of the century. I remember being called Santa Claus and wishing that I wasn't real. Jokes about my body being made by others defeated me. It killed me, and as I laid there, Bleeding, all I wish is that it made me more skinny. It's hard being my friend. Whenever I don't eat, they don't eat. Am I a monster for not loving myself, not allowing myself basic nutrition? I was vegetarian, selling myself on false happiness, but there's no better feeling than an empty belly. Like I've made it. Himalayas of starved stomach songs. This is the point where I joke about how I'll never be able to make it up Everest because I can't even catch my breath going upstairs. That's a lie. Self-deprecating as normal. I was an athlete, played basketball till midnight. My heroine panting it to the point where my gym teachers call my parents and tell them how hard I'm working, burning non-existent calories. When I'm saying I'm going to the gym, I can hear the cackles and I feel like I'm being crucified. Lord knows I would never show that much skin. I remember my dad telling me to keep playing because it made me skinny. Of course, it's always been the ultimate goal. Only the fallen have fupas and now I live in baggy clothes in the back rooms. I'll forever be the fat girl stereotype laughing at my own kind while dying on the inside because the only way to make it through this world is comedy for the wicked appealing to the horrid. I let my head hang lower than my stomach and personality carry. Fat people are the funniest. Right? Well, let me end this with a joke. What do you say to the girl who can't love herself? Nothing. She won't listen anyways. Mm -hmm.